Hello Kidlets, Mr. Flick here with another great badge from MyTechBadges.com. This one is called Google Student Level 1 and it's all about Google Docs and how to log into your Google account. Alright, I don't want to rant but I got to tell you why this badge is so important to you. It is important to you is because in the past we went crazy with documents. Okay, let me just tell you about the past, like six years ago, the past, okay? Well, before cloud computing, which Google Docs is all about, because you you actually store your document in the cloud, okay? Before that, we would create a document, and then we would send it to our colleague or our teacher or whoever, and they would have some revisions for us. Oh, we should change this or do that, and they would send it back to us. So now get, how many copies are? I've got my original, they have a copy on their computer and now they've sent, done something so and then they've sent it back to me now i've got two copies okay so then i make some more changes and i send them that one back and now they've got two copies but i've got uh, two copies over here and then they send it back now i've got three and they've got two and it just it would go so you'd have like 10 copies of one document okay so then you had to get really creative in your naming and you'd be like okay final copy zero three and then someone else so you have to then change it no final, final copy 03, or no, this is really the last copy uh, that I'm going to make 0.4 or something. You know, it was just, you would have to go crazy on these things. And this is why you're so lucky. This, this is why this badge is so important is that you don't have to go through that nightmare anymore because you just, everything's in the cloud. The document is in the cloud. So you access it, you can make changes to it and that's fine. Nothing, you don't get another copy of it. And then someone else can be over here on a different computer in a different part of the world and they can access it and they can make changes to it or they can look at it and all these people from all over can, can be in it and there's only the one copy, okay? Now you can go back in time, a little time machine and go look at revision histories, those kind of things. That's for an advanced user. But it is so cool that you don't have the nightmare that really your parents and I and older people have had to deal with when it came to document creation and management. This is why this badge is so important, period. All right, what are you gonna to need to have this badge? Really simple, three things. You need to know your, your account, your Google account, uh, login name, usually it's your email address for your school, okay? And you need to know the password for that account. So this is again from your school. And you need to have a, your device connected to the internet. Now, since this Google Docs uh, presentation and lesson is all about using the web interface, I'm not talking about being on like an iPad or a tablet with the Google Docs app. This is like using a browser like Safari or, or um, uh, being in Chrome and getting to Google Docs and using it that way. Okay, so you need to have something connected to the internet because it's the cloud. You need to access the cloud, which is, you know, the fancy fun word for the internet. Okay, to earn this badge, really easy. Just like all the badges, you normally need to do two things. One is the tutorial. So you're going to do this great tutorial on how to create this beautiful, beautiful report on volcanoes. Don't panic, I've done all the typing, you just need to format it to make it look all pretty, okay? And this is beautiful, I mean, it's got pages to it that are just really nice, it looks like a professional uh, document report for school, because it is, and you're gonna learn how to make that. So do the tutorial project on volcanoes, and then do a project for your classroom teacher, okay? So you'll do those two things, boom, you have the badge. All right, the impressive rating. Now, we are talking documents here. We're not talking making cold fusion. So this is gonna be pretty low on the impressive ratings. Uh, grandma might be a little bit impressed, so maybe a three for grandma. Uh, your teacher is going to love you for doing it, but not be all that impressed, so maybe two. And your friends are gonna have a two only because they'll be able to collaborate with you now on a document, and hey, that's cool, right? Four or five people working on the same document. What's not to love about that? All right, if you've arrived at this training tutorial and you're like, what are badges? What is this all about? Don't panic.
just head on over to mytechbadges.com. That's where I keep everything. Not really here on my YouTube channel, although it means the world to me if you can subscribe to me because that just helps out everything with YouTube and how I get ranked and rated and all those things. So subscribe to the YouTube channel, but then head on over to mytechbadges.com. That's where it's all organized. That's where I have things like this volcano report. It's already been typed in for you. You can just copy and paste it from there. But that's basically how it works. My name is Mr. Flickinger. Most kids call me Mr. Flick. And I've created all these tutorials to help bring some sense to tech learning in the uh, school. Okay, so that's what it's all about. Enjoy this one. We're going to have a lot of fun together. I like to make trainings kind of fun and quirky. So we're going to have a lot of fun with this. So I'll see you on the inside when we start talking about training tutorials and those kind of things.